it's a, one of the difficulties with dealing with a foreign seller in the United States. I'm going back and forth with this agent trying to do this deal and I'm trying to work out a creative situation, but they were saying that the seller is trying to move back to Spain and that he's subject to, I think, this uh, FERPTA tax. And so he was saying, like, the number that he wanted, I think he wanted, like, no less than 350 But basically, it didn't work. So I was trying to work out, you know, like a seller finance situation because the house is paid off. But the agent was basically saying that because of this uh, FERPTA tax, that um, it was going to affect the sale. So I just wanted to get some clarity as to, like, is there a way around? Is there a way I, the buyer can assume that tax? Like, how does that work? And is no, there- no, okay. it's that's the it's a, one of the difficulties with dealing with a foreign seller in the United States. Uh, your buyer is actually liable for the tax implication of the seller if the seller doesn't pay their capital gains tax, believe it or not. And so no buyer is going to ever, ever, ever assume the tax liability of a seller because that could be in the hundreds of thousands of dollars in capital gains tax. This video is brought to you by subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Oh, the other part is at closing, every title company is required to have, by law, they're required to have the buyer sign a disclosure that lets them know that they are liable for the seller's taxes if the seller doesn't pay their capital gains tax. Did you know that? No, I had no idea. This was the first time I even heard about this. Yes. I don't know how the IRS enforces this or how they can even do it, but it's it's true. And the way that it works is that if I'm... So I did a deal with a Canadian once and the Canadian... I had to sign a document stating that that if, this, if the Canadian seller did not pay capital gains tax on the property that I would be liable for the capital gains tax that they owed. Even though I had no, like I have, how am I going to make a seller pay his taxes? Wow. How am I ever going to make somebody pay their taxes? And how can this possibly be my liability or my financial responsibility to make sure that somebody pays their taxes? But that's how the tax code is written. Thanks for watching another one of my YouTube videos. Now it's your turn to go out and take some action. But before you do, like and subscribe to my channel because the law of reciprocity means you owe me, bitch.